Talking more about food, the company that supplies one-fifth of America's chickens will stop using antibiotics on those chickens. Tyson's Foods, you may know them as the factory farmers extraordinaire churning out more chickens than anyone else in the United States. If you lined up five chickens at your supermarket, one of them would be from Tyson's all across the country, okay? The country's biggest poultry supplier is announcing that they plan to eliminate the use of human antibiotics in all of their fleet by 2017. Now, this coincidentally coincides with McDonald's pledge in the next two years to remove all antibiotic dosed chicken from their menu, okay? That makes sense, right? You see in the connection, Tyson is McDonald's biggest supplier. So would Tyson be doing this on their own? I can tell you with pretty high certainty, absolutely not, because they put antibiotics in their chicken because it makes them more money. Now, the ethical concerns don't seem to bother them. The health concerns don't seem to bother them. The concerns about the welfare of the chickens, that doesn't seem to bother them at all. But when you start talking about the almighty dollar and McDonald's says, hey, we can't use you if you're going to start pumping these chickens with more human antibiotics, then it's time to make a change, right? So kudos to Tyson for doing the right thing. Unfortunately, as it often does, it takes a couple dollar signs to make the right thing happen. But the bottom line is, listen, dosing our animals with these antibiotics is a bad idea. It's causing problems. It's creating antibiotic resistant superbugs. We're currently dosing more animals with human antibiotics than we are dosing humans. That's a problem. Let me know what you think about this in the comments below, folks. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.